Husbandry of Selected Crops In our last topic, we got to know that crops are classified based on their life cycle and based on their uses. Based on their life cycle, we have the annual crops, the biannual crops, the perennial crops. And based on their uses, we have the cereal crops, the pulses, the root and tuber crops, the vegetable crops, fruit crops, beverage crops, spices, oil crops, fiber crops, and the lattice crops. Talking about May, which has its botanical name as Z maize. Z maize, also known as corn, is a member of the grass family, the graminae. It is a cereal crop which produces grains that can be used as food by human beings as well as livestock. The seed or fruit of maize is a caropsis. It has its epicarp fused with the mesocarp. The land preparation of maize is done by clearing the land or bush with cutlass, making heaps or ridges with hoe or mechanically. Z maize or maize has different varieties which include the dent maize, the flint corn, the flour corn, the popcorn, the sweet corn, and the pod corn. Maize requires a temperature of 26 degrees centigrade to 30 degrees centigrade. It also needs rainfall between 75 centimeters to 100 centimeters per annum as well as a drained sandy loamy soil of pH 6 to 7. The method of propagation of maize is by seeds. Early maize should be planted between March to April and late maize is planted around July to August. Planting can be done manually or mechanically by planters. Maize has different cultural practices which include the supplying, the thinning, the fertilizer application, the weeding, and the control of pests and diseases. Diseases of maize are the corn smut, the maize rust, leaf spot, and the maize streak. Pests that attack maize are the stem borers, the grasshoppers, and the weevil. Rice, which has its name as Oriza sativa. Rice is another popular cereal crop grown and consumed by nearly half of the world's population. It is also a member of the grass family, the graminae. The seed or fruit of rice is a caropsis, that is, it has its epicarp fused with a mesocarp. The land preparation of rice is done either manually using cutlass and hose or mechanically by plowing, harrowing and ridging. Varieties of rice include the swamp rice and the upland rice. The climatic or soil requirement of rice is a temperature of over 20 degrees centigrade and the method of propagation is by seed. Rice is planted in southern Nigeria around April or May and between August and September in the north. Planting of rice is done by broadcasting, sowing or drilling of the seeds at 2 to 4 centimeters deep. Swamp rice requires nursery which is done in fertile water soaked soil. Seeds are broadcast and germination begins after four to five days and the seedlings are transplanted at between seven to eight weeks of growth to the field. Seeds are sown in nursery around May to June and transplanted in July to August to the field. When planting a rice, the space in between each other should be about 25 centimeters to 30 centimeters apart depending on variety. The cultural practices, by cultural practices we mean those things done when planting. The cultural practices of rice are supply and thinning, 
as this can be done where applicable, fertilizer application, weeding, and pest and disease control. Rice matures in four to seven months depending on its variety. When harvesting rice, red heads of rice are cut off with knife, sickle, or combined harvester. Pests that attack rice are the beds, the rodents, and the weevils. Diseases suffered by rice are the rice smut, the rice blight, and the brown leaf spot. Yam, which has its botanical name as Dioscoria specie. Yam is a root and tuber crop popularly grown in West Africa and it is rich in carbohydrates. In planting yam, colors and hoe is used to clear and make ridges or it can be done mechanically. Yam has different varieties. We have the white yam, which is known as the Dioscoria rotundata, the water yam, which is known as the Dioscoria alata, the aerial yam, which is known as the Dioscoria bulbifera, the yellow yam, which is known as Dioscoria cainensis, and also the bitter yam, which is known as the Dioscoria dementorum. The method of propagation of yam is by yam sets, yam seeds, or yam mini sets. And this is done by putting one seed yam or set per hole. Early yam is planted around November to December, while late yam is planted around March to April. Yam also has its cultural practices, which includes mulching, regular weeding, application of fertilizer, staking, and training of vine. Mulching is the covering of the heaps or ridges with dry leaves to reduce soil temperature, conserve soil moisture, and prevent rotting of yam sets. Yam matures in 8 to 12 months, and the pests that attack yam are the yam tuber beetle, the yam shoot beetle, and rodents, while diseases suffered by yam are the yam mosaic disease, the yam rot, and the yam leaf spot. Cassava, which has its botanical name as the manihot species. Just like yam, it is a root and tuber crop. It has underground roots which can be consumed by man and livestock animals after processing. It has other advantages over yam in that it can grow in relatively poor soil and a low rainfall area. The root is also rich in carbohydrates. In planting cassava, land preparation is done with cutlass and hose or mechanically. Stomping is also done. The climatic or soil requirement of cassava is a temperature of about 21 to 35 degrees and also rainfall of about 150 centimeters, 200 centimeters. A well-drained, rich, friable, loamy soil is required and it can also grow in poor soil. The planting date of cassava is from March to September. The cultural practices involved in cassava are weeding, fertilizer application, the maturity period which occurs between 8 to 15 months depending on the variety. We also have the harvesting practice, the processing and the storage. Diseases that affect cassava are the cassava mosaic disease, bacteria blight and the angular leaf spots. Pests that attack the cassava are the variegated grasshopper and rodents. Cowpea, which has its botanical name as Vigna unguiculata. The cowpea is a member of the pulses or legumes. It belongs to the family called leguminosae. It is rich in proteins and is commonly fed on by man. The fruit of cowpea is called a pod. In planting cowpea, the land is cleared and the weed gotten from the land is burnt and stomping, plowing, hurrying and ridging is done in 
sequence. Varieties of cowpea, the erect type, the creeping type, the ephe brown type, etc. The climatic and soil requirement of cowpea is a temperature of about 27 centigrade to 35 centigrade and also rainfall of about 60 to 125 centimeters. The climatic or soil requirement of cowpea is a temperature of about 27 to 35 degrees centigrade and the rainfall of about 60 to 125 centimeters. The method of propagation of cowpea is by seeds. The planting of cowpea is done early April and late August. The cultural practices of cowpea involves thinning, weeding and fertilizer application. Cowpea matures between three to four months after planting and it is stored in jute bags. In the harvesting of cowpea, brown mature or ripe pods are harvested by hand picking. Early maturing varieties are harvested three months after planting while late maturing varieties are harvested after four months. We are to harvest mature dry pods before shattering. Harvested pods are dried under the sun and shelling is done by beating the dry pods with sticks or by pounding lightly in a mortar on a small scale. Shellers are used on a large scale and winnowing is carried out whereby broken shells or pods are removed from the beans. The pests of cow are the pod borer, the bean beetle and the leaf Hoppers. Where the diseases suffered by cowpea are the cowpea mosaic disease, bacterial blight, nematode disease, and damping of disease. The cotton. The cotton has its botanical name to be the gossipium species. Cotton is a fiber crop and belongs to the plant family called the malvaceae and belongs to the plant family called the Malvaceae. It produces cotton lint, which is a white fiber used in textile industries. In the planting of cotton, the land is cleared with cutlass or mechanically plowed and harrowed to make it soft for planting of cotton seeds. Cotton has different varieties which include the Gossipium hirisitum, the Gossipium Vitifolium, the Asian type, the Samaru, the Gossipium peruvanium, or the Meco cotton. The climatic or soil requirement of cotton is a temperature of about 25 to 35 degrees centigrade and a rainfall of about 65 to 125 centimeters. The method of propagation of cotton is by seeds. The planting date of cotton is in June and July in northern Nigeria. Cotton has weeding, fertilizer application and mulching as its cultural practices and cotton matures within five to eight months after planting. In harvesting cotton, matured fruits or balls are hand-picked and sun-dried. The pests that attack cotton are the cotton stainer, also known as the disdecus species, and the ball worms. While diseases suffered by cotton are the bacteria blight, the leaf curl, and the damping off. Tomato. Tomato has its botanical name as Lycopersicon esculetum. It is a vegetable crop commonly grown by peasant farmers in West Africa. The fruit called berry when ripe can be eaten raw. It can be used for soup or stew preparation or in preparing vegetable salad and other food. In the planting of tomato, land is cleared with cutlass and ridges are made with local hoe or land can be prepared by plowing, harrowing and ridging. Tomato has different varieties which include the money maker, the valiant, the pork, the dwarf gem species, the maglobe, the ife plum, the bonita, the roma, the local varieties. 
and the climatic or soil requirement of tomato is a temperature of about 20 to 25 degrees centigrade and a rainfall of about 50 to 125 centimeters. The method of propagation of tomato is by seeds. Tomato has nursery practices and cultural practices. The nursery practices is done on ground, bed, or seed boxes or trays with top soil, thoroughly mixed and watered. Seeds are sown in drills, 5 cm apart and 2.5 cm deep. Shading, mulching, weeding and watering are done. And nursery lasts for 3 weeks when the plants are at the tree leaf stage. The cultural practices of tomato involves the weeding, the watering, which is done after planting, the fertilizer application and stacking. Stacking here provides stakes to enable plants stand erect and prevent lodging. Stems are tied or trained to the stakes. Staking allows for good fruiting and keeps fruit from disease attack arising from contact with soil. Staking should be done before flowering. The pests that attack tomato are the cricket and beetle, while the diseases suffered by tomato are the fusarium wilt or the root rot, the root knot disease, the bacterial wilt, and the leaf spot disease. The okra, which has its botanical name as Abelmoscus esculentus. The okra is a vegetable crop commonly grown by local farmers in West Africa. The fruits, called capsule, when young, are harvested with knife and used in soup preparation. In preparing the land for okra planting, the bush is cleared with cutlass while ridges or heaps are constructed with holes. It can also be done by plowing, harrowing and ridging. Okra, okra has different varieties which include the new lady's finger and the Perkins long the climatic or soil requirement of okra is a temperature of about 18 to 30 degrees centigrade and a rainfall of about 100 centimeters to 150 centimeters per annum and a well-drained loamy soil. The method of propagation of okra is by seeds and the planting date is early April and May. The spacing should be about 60 cm by 60 cm. Seeds are planted directly into beds, 2 to 3 seeds per hole, which should be 3 cm deep. Germination occurs as from the fifth day after planting. The pests that attack okra are the flea beetles, the crickets, and the grasshopper, while the diseases suffered by okra are the root knot disease and the mosaic disease. The orange. The orange has its botanical name as Citrus sinensis. Orange is a fruit crop which belongs to the citrus family. The fruit of orange called berry is succulent, fleshy and juicy and it is rich in vitamins and minerals. The land is cleared with cutlass and stomping is done. The land could be plowed and harrowed mechanically. The orange has different varieties. We have the sweet orange, which has its botanical name as the citrus sinensis. The sour orange, which has its botanical name as the citrus orantium. The lime, which has its botanical name as the citrus orantifolia. The tangerine, which has its botanical name as Citrus reticulata. We have the lemon, which has its botanical name as Citrus limon. The grapefruit, which has its botanical name as Citrus paradisi. The shaddock, also known as pomelo, which has its botanical name as Citrus grandis. And the king orange, which has its botanical name as Citrus nobilis. The climatic or soil requirement of orange is a temperature of about 25 to 35 degrees centigrade and a rainfall of about 75 centimeters to 125 centimeters per annum. In planting orange, the materials required are orange seeds, 
the bordered seedlings and the grafted seedlings. The method of propagation in orange planting is done by seeds sexually and vegetative propagation, for example, budding. In planting orange, the pre-nursery is ideal between October and December and the nursery in April and May. Budding should be done a year later. Orange has its nursery practices and its cultural practices. In nursery practices, we have the pre-nursery stage and here seeds are raised in seed trays by October to December in a loamy soil rich in organic matter and seeds are sown 3 cm by 3 cm at 2 cm deep. While in the nursery practice, the seedlings are now replanted at 60 cm by 60 cm spacing. It should be planted around April and May. Take two. It is planted around April and May. Watering, weeding and shading are provided. Boarding and grafting are done a year later. Orange has nursery and cultural practices. The nursery practices involves the pre-nursery, the nursery and the transplanting. In the pre-nursery, the seeds are raised in seed trays by October to December in a loamy soil rich in organic matter. The seeds are sown 3 cm by 3 cm at 2 cm deep. While in the nursery, the seedlings are now replanted at 60 cm by 60 cm spacing. It is planted around April and May. Watering, weeding and shading are provided and boarding and grafting are done a year later. In transplanting, after one year of budding, the seedlings are transplanted to the field at a spacing of 7.0 meters by 7.0 meters. Involves weeding, fertilizer application, mulching, irrigation, pruning, and insect and disease control. Harvesting is done by clean or spot picking. The pests that attack orange are the traits the red mites, the scale insects, the aphids, the fruit borers, the caterpillars, and the leaf hoppers. While the diseases suffered by oranges are the gumosis, the tristeza, and the satus scab. The banana. The banana has its botanical name as the Musa species. In banana planting, the land is cleared, which is followed by stomping and making of ridges or heaps. It can also be done mechanically. Banana has different varieties, which include the cross Michael, the Cavendish, the red banana, and the canary banana. The climatic or soil requirements of banana is a temperature of about 21 to 25 degrees centigrade and a rainfall of about 150 to 200 centimeters per annum. Planting materials for banana are the banana suckers. And banana is planted anytime from April to September. The cultural practices involved in banana plantation are the climatic or soil requirements of banana is a temperature of about 21 to 25 degrees centigrade and a rainfall of about 150 to 200 centimeters per annum. The planting materials of banana is the banana sucker. Banana is planted anytime from April to September. Banana has its cultural practices. Banana has weeding, mulching, fertilizer application, pruning, and pest and disease take two, pest control take two, and pest control as its cultural practices. The pests that disturb bananas are the stem borer, the nematode, the rats and monkeys, while diseases suffered by bananas are the Panama disease the leaf spot or the cigatoka take two, or the cigatoka disease and the bunchy top disease the cocoa woods take two, the cocoa the cocoa has its boots take two. 
The cocoa has its botanical name as the Theobroma cacoa. The cocoa is a beverage crop used in the preparation of many food drinks like Ovaltine, Bon Vita, Pronto, etc. in Nigeria. It belongs to the plant family called Seculaceae. Called Seculaceae. It belongs to the plant family called Seculites. It belongs to the plant family called the Seculatia. The fruit is called Cocoa. The fruit is called Cocoa Pod. The land is cleared with cutlass after which stomping is done. It can also be prepared mechanically. Cocoa has different varieties which include the Amelonado, the, Amel, the, the Amelonado, the Amazon Criollo, the Amazon Criollo Trintriario, The cocoa has different varieties which include the um, which include the Amlonado, the Amazon Criollo Trinitrio and the hybrids and the hybrids. The climatic or soil requirement of the cocoa is the climatic or soil requirement of the cocoa is a temperature of about 17 to 21 degrees centigrade and a rainfall of about 114 to 200 centimeters rainfall and a rainfall of about 100 and, and a rainfall of 114 to 200 centimeters per annum. The method of propagation is by seeds is by seeds and also vegetatively by budding and stem cutting. Planting date of the cocoa In the planting date of the cocoa, the nursery is done October to January while transplanting is done between April and June. The cocoa has its The cocoa has weeding, shading, fertilizer application, mulching, pruning, as its cultural practices. The processes the processes involved in cocoa are the breaking of pots, fermentation, drying and storage. In fermentation, cocoa beans can be fermented by using the sweat box or tray method for about five days. During the fermentation process, cocoa beans undergoes chemical changes brought about by the action of heat. The beans changes to a brown the beans changes to a brown color and develops the characteristic chocolate flavor. Theobromine is one of the properties of fermentation. This substance gives cocoa its stimulating property. The pests that attack cocoa are the cocoa capsids and the mealy bugs. Pepe. The botanical name for pepe is the cap is the capsicum species. The pepe is a spice crop which adds flavor to our stew and soup. It can be used when green or red, and it is rich in vitamins and minerals. It belongs to the plant family known as the it's, it belongs to the tixer. it belongs to the plant family called the solanis called the solanis it belongs to a plant family called the solan tixu, called the solanis in preparing Pepe for <laughs> In preparing pepper for, for planting In preparing pepper for planting, the bush is cleared and ridges or heaps are made with hoe. 
It can also be prepared mechanically. Pepper has different varieties, which are the sweet pepper, which is also known as the capiscum anum, the chili pepper, the bird's eye pepper, known as the capiscum fruticens. Take two. The sweet pepper, known as the capiscum manum, the chili pepper, and the bird's eye pepper, known as the capiscum fruticens. The climatic or soil requirement of pepper is a temperature of about 15 to 27 degrees centigrade and a rainfall of about 100 to 150 centimeters per annum. The method of propagation of pepper is by seeds. Is by seeds. And the planting date of take two. And the planting date of the nursery is about take two. and the planting date of pepper in the nursery is from February to March while the transplanting is done around April or May the nursery practices involves the drilling of seed the provision of shade for the pepper watering weeding and planting Planting is done when plant is 10 cm to 15 cm tall. Transplanting is done with ball of earth on the root. Transplanting is done with the ball of earth on the root to the field. Transplanting is done around April and May. Transplanting is done around April and May. Cultural practices of pepper planting involves weeding, mulching, fertilizer, weeding, mulching, and fertilizer application. The pests that attack pepper are the cricket and grasshoppers. While the disease, while the diseases suffered by pepper are the leaf spots, damping off, and the leaf coil. The oil palm. The oil palm, which has its botanical name as the Elais guinnessis, belongs to the plant family called the palmi, or take two, called the palmi, take two, called the palmi or palm family. On commercial basis, both the oil and the kernel are important. The oil is obtained from the mesocarp and the kernel from the endocarp. The fruit is called a drupe. Oil palm is an oil crop. In preparing the oil palm for planting, in preparing the palm for planting, the land is cleared and hoe is used to take two. In preparing the palm for planting, the land is cleared and hoe is used to make heaps or ridges. Take two. Or ridges. Flat land can be used for growing oil palm. Oil palm has different varieties, which are the Dura, the Pisifera, and the Tenara. And the, tenara. the climatic or soil requirement of oil palm is a temperature of about 18 to 27 degrees centigrade and rainfall of 150 centimeters to 200 centimeters per annum. The method of propagation is by seeds. The method of propagation is by seeds. The method of propagation is by seeds. In planting, in the planting date, the pre-nursery is done August to October, while the nursery is done nine months later, and it is taken to the field or transplanted March to May, that is a year after the seed rate is around one the seed rate is a hundred and twenty to a hundred and fifty seeds seeds are take two to a hundred and fifty seeds in the germination of seeds seeds are soaked in water for seven days the water being changed daily after seven days the seeds are placed in the shade for 24 hours to dry before being bagged. Before being bagged in polythene bags.
They are then sent to the germinator, which has a temperature of about 39 degrees centigrade or one take two of about 39 degrees centigrade, which is approximately 102 degrees Fahrenheit for 80 days. Soaking then begins again and continues for seven days, the water being changed daily. The seeds are then dried under the shade for two hours before being sent to the cooling house. After about two weeks, germination begins. This method produces a germination percentage of about 85 to 90%. We also have the nursery operation, which requires a well-leveled texture which requires a level well drained loamy soil take two which requires a level well drained loamy soil the nursery is plowed and harrowed or pollutin bags are used planting is done early april during which the seedlings are removed with a ball of earth take two take two the cultural practices involved in planting of oil palm includes weeding, fertilizer application, cover crops, and pruning. Fruits, the oil potato, the oil palm is harvested when the fruits are red or dark. Based on the quantity, take two, the oil palm or the palm oil is take two. The oil palm is graded based on the quantity of free fatty acids, that is, the soft oil, take two, based on the quantity of free fatty acids, and it is graded into the soft oil, the hard oil, and the special oil. The pests that attack oil palm are the rodents, while diseases suffered by oil palm are the blast disease, the antro, take two, the anthracnose, the Freckle disease and the Galadima disease. The rubber. The rubber has its botanical name to be Hevia brasiliensis. Heba takes you. Heva brasiliensis. Rubber is the only popular latex crop which produces white sticky liquid used in plastic industries. It belongs to the plant family Euphobiasis. Take two. It belongs to the plant family Euphobiasis. The land is cleared, stomping is done, and the land may be leveled. Take two. In the land preparation of rubber, the land is cleared, stomping is done, and the land may be leveled or it can be done by plowing and harrowing. The varieties of rubber are the PB86, the Dull Garden, take two, the Dull Garden, the BD5, the Herbal One, take two, the Herbal One, and the PB5 over, take two, and the PB551. The climatic or soil requirement of rubber is a temperature of about 24 to 29 degrees centigrade and a rainfall of 180 to, two, to 300 centimeters per annum. The method of propagation of rubber is by seeds and budded seedlings. The planting date of rubber the pre nursery of rubber is done around August to October, while the nursery is done nine months later after the take two, while the take two, while the nursery is done nine months later and the budding is done February to April. Take two. And the budding is done February to April. And the burden is done February to April. Nursery practices include the pre-nursery, the nursery, the planting. While the cultural practices in include take two. While the cultural practices involves the weeding, the mulching, the pruning, the plant take two, the pruning and the planting of cover crops. The pests that attack rubber are the mealy bugs. While diseases of rubber 
includes the tapping panel disease, the white and the red rod diseases. We also have the granot, which has its botanical name as Arashis hypogea, as a Harashi's hypogea. The granot, <coughs> the granot is a dual purpose crop, which can be cultivated as an oil crop, as an oil crop, as well as a protein or a pulse or leguminous crop. Although it is a leguminous crop, it is mainly grown for its oil. The seed, called nut, contains about 40 to 55 percent oil, 30 percent protein, and 18 percent carbohydrate. The industrial product of granite includes the granite cake, take two, includes the industrial product, take two, the industrial product of granite includes the granite cake, granite oil, and granite butter. The land preparation in the land preparation of granite, the land is cleared, stomping is done, and land can also be prepared mechanically by plowing, harrowing, and ridging. Granite has different varieties or cultivars. They include the bunch or erect type, the creeping type, the cano local, the cano 50, and the castle, and the castle carry. The climatic and soil requirement of granite is a temperature of about 25 to 30 degrees centigrade and a rainfall of about 70 to take two, and a rainfall of about 70 to 100 centimeters per annum. Granite requires a coarse texture which is sandy or loamy soil. Take two. Granite requires a coarse texture of either sandy or loamy soil which is slightly acidic to neutral, that is, pH range of 5 to 7. The soil should be rich in calcium and, and phosphorus, which are needed for pore formation. The method of propagation of granite is by seeds, and the planting date of granite is March to April in the south and May to June in the north. The seed rate of granite is 30 to 35 kilograms, or two to three seeds per hole. It should be spaced. It should be given a. It should be spaced forty to sixty cm by twenty centimeters for the creeping type, and sixty cm by fifteen centimeters for the bunch type. Granite is planted by seeds and can be planted solely or may be intercropped. It involves weeding. If it involves weeding, and the stem of the granite may be take two. Take two. Harvesting of granite is done when the lower leaves turn brown and begins to fall. Pests that attack granite are the rodents, which include rats, which dig up, take two, which dig up and eat sown seeds. We also have the granite beetle. Take two. Pests that attack the granite are the rodent and the control are the rodent and the granite beetle. Diseases that attack the granite are the granite rosette disease, the ticker disease, and the aspergillus disease.